From Central New York's most dependable weather team, here's meteorologist Violet Skybor. Welcome back, everyone. Quiet conditions for right now, but we are going to see the chance for snow as we head into your Monday and even a second chance as we look towards the middle of the week. A live look from our Cavi Tower Cam tonight. Quiet conditions, cloudy outside and cool. Definitely dress warm before you head outside tomorrow. And if you live in the north country, you'll want some extra time. We are going to see some black ice as temperatures drop below freezing tonight. A live look from our Yorkville Battery Storm Tracker 2 radar. A couple of light lake effect flurries out by Oswego, but those are going to die down tonight as the wind direction does begin to change. But that doesn't mean the chance for snow is going to go away. In the morning, this low pressure system is just going to skim us. We're not going to get rain from this, but we will get a little bit of a light snow in the southern valleys tomorrow morning. Then tomorrow afternoon, a second system is going to move into the region. This one is going to bring scattered lake effect snow showers all across the region throughout tomorrow afternoon and evening. And even behind that cold front, some much cooler air is going to move into the region as well. So summing all of this up again tomorrow morning, light snow in the southern valleys tomorrow afternoon and evening scattered lake effect snow showers all across the region. But overall in general, we're only expecting a light snowfall accumulation from all of this. Timing out your forecast tonight, quiet conditions, mostly cloudy skies, lows dropping down to 30 degrees, starting in the 30s and staying in the 30s for your Monday highs only reach 36 degrees. Starting off the morning with a few snow showers in the southern valleys and then by the afternoon to evening, that's when scattered light lake effect snow showers begin to pop up and those will continue until Monday night, producing a little bit of a light accumulation. How much we can expect around one to two inches for the North Country, a trace to one inch for the Mohawk Valley and the Southern Valleys as well. And this is throughout the day on Monday. Now looking towards the middle of the week, we have a second chance to see snowfall and this one does look like a heavier one. On Wednesday, late in the day, looking towards Wednesday evening, Wednesday night is when the snow begins, becomes widespread overnight, eventually ending late Thursday morning. But the heaviest accumulation is only going to be for the southern valleys. This is still three days out, so just a heads up, but we will have a snowfall forecast for you tomorrow with the most accurate data. So for tonight, a low around 30 degrees, cloudy skies, a couple of flurries in the north country. No accumulation tonight, but we will have accumulation tomorrow as snow showers arrive in the afternoon with highs in the upper 30s. Here's a look at the rest of your forecast. Snow showers late Wednesday, early Thursday, dropping down into the 20s and then the teens overnight. And then we stay cool looking into next weekend, but at least we get a little bit of sun on Friday and Saturday before another weather system arrives on Sunday. Brent.